MS is an autoimmune disease. The immune system attacks one's own body and causes damage to the brain and spinal cord. And there are two stages of MS. One is the earlier stages where it's called the relapsing remitting stage where people have attacks and then recover. And later there's a stage called the progressive stage where it becomes progressively more uh, damaging to someone. I thought everybody would perceive me differently. I thought they would perceive me as not having any worth. I was afraid I couldn't keep my job because I couldn't work 12 hours a day. I was scared. At the time I was drafted by the Boston Bruins and uh, the first thing that came to my mind when I heard I had MS was that I, would, I couldn't tell anybody. I was scared that they wouldn't sign me to a professional contract after I was done with college. say to me oh my gosh you're so crazy you have so much energy uh, you uh, you know you're always happy what's going on and I say because I know what it's like not to feel like this
amazing to think um, how much MS literally turned my life upside down. Um, being healthy and active and everything else to all of a sudden not being able to do a thing. gave me the time to focus on what was actually important in life. I was too busy before to actually stop and pay attention to that. As soon as I heard, you have a disease and there's no cure, that was completely foreign to me. People were really afraid for me, and I knew at that point that I had to be the one to get better. So I decided in my mind that I was gonna fight. 
it is a complicated disease and there's so many different angles to it and so many people have so many different symptoms and no one's the same in their response to the drugs. That's why it's taking, you know, it's more complicated and taking a little longer. You know, we've made such huge strides in such a short time, so I'm just so hopeful that we can find a cure or at least to stop it when you're first diagnosed. I'm going back before I had MS and what would I say to myself today? I would say, allow yourself some time. It's going to be a little bit of an adjustment, but there is hope. You will live a full and satisfying life. And there is a purpose for you exactly the way you are, even with MS. <laughs>